what is going on everybody hope everyone is having an awesome day before we get started here if you haven't here before go ahead and get on there and click subscribe that way you can get get plugged in with all the future content here coming to the channel but um today i'm going to be um getting a little something that i ordered on amazon and seeing how it helps helps the truck here so i'm gonna go ahead and unbox that and show you guys what we got here So as you can see I went and ordered some Armor All Outlast brake dust repellent. So one of the bigger issues that I have with this truck and it just makes it not look good especially after it hasn't been washed in a while is the brake dust that sticks to the tires and sticks to the wheels. And as you can see where I just ran my finger across it there a minute ago is how, how the brake dust is already on and how dirty it is. Then you can even begin to see the brake dust back there in the back on the of oh, just the, the rusty orangey kind of look of the brake dust. So I'm going to put it on here. I'm going to get the wheels all shined up and cleaned up and put it on here and I'll be able to show you guys how it works. And in a later video, I'll go and give my review on it and see how well it works. It was only, it was only $8 on Amazon for it. So it should become very helpful, hopefully just for the, the look since of the these, Since these wheels are all dirty and brake dust just from the few miles that I've already drove on, I'm going to go ahead and clean the wheel and tire up and then, then I'll go ahead and put the coating on. Also, if you're wondering why my tire foam looks so funny whenever it comes out, it's because it's been in my cold garage for a while now, and we've had, we've had some cold temperatures here here lately, so it's still a little cold. just don't want to come out of the can very easily. So normally I don't spray the, the tire foam or anything like that on the tires because it will sling back on your vehicles and stuff once you put it on there. But with the, with the directions on the Outlast brake dust repellent, it says to clean your wheels up real good and spray the tire foam on it because then once once you spray the the brake dust repellent on it it will put like a hardener kind of on your wheel kind of almost like a ceramic coating like is the way it's talking but yet yeah, it says it's supposed to last up to four weeks it says using 65 plus degrees which of course you can see i'm wearing toboggan it's it's 50 here today just toboggan's a little comfy comfy on me but um it says go ahead and spray it on there then it shouldn't sling up on your vehicle because it's putting a hardener on it now, I can say that I did, when I ceramic coated this truck, I did go and put the ceramic coat on the wheels also, but the brake dust is still sticking to it. So I'm now going to put this on it and see if that helps the issue or not. What I say was that it also says make sure your wheel is dry to put this on there. So I'm going to let this tire foam and everything else go and dry up on the wheel pretty good. I'll give it 20 or 30 minutes or so, let it dry, and then I'll come back and, and put it on. There we go. We're gonna let her dry. We're gonna let her dry. Going back her back under the carport here and let her dry out. And it says give her an hour, get her dry, and see how she works. Okay, so I hope that was helpful for everyone. Um, I'll give a review here in the next month or less here on whatever I, what it comes up with it, keeping the keeping the brake dust off and everything else of it. Hopefully it does and it works good because I know I don't like all the brake dust on it, making the tire look orange and everything else. And everyone probably noticed all the stuff I used in this um, in this video was from Armor All. I'm not sponsored by them or anything. It just happens to be all the products that I use in my vehicles. And I'm slowly using up all my Armor All products. And I'm switching to Jack's Wax products. So that's kind of what I'm up for. I'm not sponsored by them either. I'd, it'd be awesome to be sponsored by them because I just love all their products. I use all their products and everything else. But Armor, the Armor All one was just the cheapest one and there was only two that came up on Amazon when I punched in it was this one for eight dollars and then there was a Meguiar's one for 45 I figured go for the cheap one try it out and then we can always try the, the other one later but I'll put the link in the description below for for the Armor All Outlast brake repellent and if you found this video helpful and you or you haven't been here before get in there and click subscribe give this video a thumbs up if it was if it was helpful and just thanks everyone for for watching and for supporting the channel and 
watching it grow just thank you everyone for that you and just everyone have a have an awesome have a blessed day